Kunstner and I'm in the Engineering and Technology Academy in the Engineering Pathway. After high school, I plan to go to UNL to major in Mechanical Engineering. You can do pretty much anything from doing stuff like robotics or just pretty much lots of everyday items happen to come from Mechanical Engineering. I've always been pretty good at math and science and then I also love to build Legos and I still do. And uh, that definitely once I realized, oh hey, I can put all of these things together into a field that I can do later on in life, it seemed like something I wanted to be a part of. I think especially in my sophomore year, I was a part of a mentoring group for, engineer for women in engineering. And so we got to go out to different places in the community and learn more about them. And that definitely really helped me figure out what I want to do as an engineer. And then also taking some of my AP classes have helped me learn what I exactly it is I want to do. When I took my engineering classes, they had different times where you'd work on certain types of engineering because there's many different types. And just seeing the ways each one works, I got an idea of which ones I liked and which ones I didn't really think I'd want to pursue in the future. And that really helped me narrow it down to what I want to do. Probably my favorite memories from GISH are being a part of show choir and band and theater, which are all very, much, lots of activities that I've been a part of and keep me very busy, so I'm always doing them and I have made lots of friends from them and they definitely have been a great place to be. My name is Clark Bexker and I'm part of the Education Law and Public Safety Academy and I'm in the Education Pathway. My plan is to go to Hastings College where I will major in Music Education. My goal is to probably become a music teacher at the probably the middle school level and then move up to high school level. Through all the activities I've been involved with like theater and speech and choir and band, all of those things, they've helped me a lot, especially speech, because I've, I've been able to become a better speaker because of it. And music is just such a passion for me. And especially when I came up here, I really, my love for music grew a lot. I think I'm gonna miss some of the terrific teachers that we have. It's been a terrific experience being a part of the music department here at the school. I absolutely love music and I, I can't wait to learn more about it in depth and all the music theory and how to teach children this wonderful skill that they have for the rest of their life. Kenzie Skarka. I am in the Medical Academy and the Sports Medicine and Therapy Pathway. I would like to go to UNL and study pre-physical therapy. So as a freshman we were given a whole bunch of options and going through all of them with my teacher we were able to kind of pick and choose what fits best for us and I decided that medical is kind of my, my fit. Through my pathway I was able to see classes and what physical therapy looks like. I was also able to job shadow in different physical therapy fields. I'd like to become a doctor of physical therapy and and that's about seven years of school. If I can own my own practice, that'd be amazing. I think just getting any sort of experience in a broad general field, that would still be amazing. Between all of the classes that I was able to take and getting out and job shadowing and speakers, they've all been able to help prepare me for what my future can look like. I will miss seeing all the friendly and familiar faces all around the halls. It's just been so nice. You walked in the hall and say hi, and everybody just knows you by name, and it's so friendly here. I'm Megan Hickson. I'm in the Technical Sciences Academy and the Construction Pathway. 
Um, I plan on attending college and getting my AAS degree in construction management. I'm going to go to Central Community College in Hastings. I want to have my own like construction business and run my own business. Being in the construction pathway, we got to build two houses, like two whole houses, top to bottom, before we even get to graduate high school. And I know a lot of the kids starting college have never done that before, so I've gotten a lot of experience. I mean, just building houses, doing what I want to do in the future. I definitely like the actual building, like the hands-on part of it, because you get to like put it together yourself, and then when you step back and look at it, you get to see it all come together, and you did that. I really like the framing part, because that's when you see the house really start to come together. I'm going to miss a lot of the teachers that I've met, and also the wrestling team. It's been like honestly really life changing. It was so, so much fun. All the connections you make, even though it is like a fighting sport or whatever, it's really nothing like that. All the girls are so nice. When you go to tournaments and like you wrestle someone, maybe they beat you, you beat them. Off the mat, you still talk to each other, you're friends. It's just a great experience. I'm honestly really excited to start college. Being in this pathway, I've already completed four classes, so I think I might be able to graduate in a year and a half. Even though I'm going full time, I have a lot of classes online that I can do in my free time so I can still work and I'm really excited to just start pursuing my career in building houses. Hi, my name is Riley Huff. I am in the Business Academy and my pathway is Finance and Management. I plan to attend CCC and I plan to major in Business Administration to further my education on managing properties and businesses because I plan to become a realtor and a landlord. My ultimate career goals is to become a developer and work with my father in developing neighborhoods and like duplexes and townhomes and everything like that. Ever since I was little, my, my dad has been a landlord and I've gone and helped him clean out houses and get properties ready for people to move in. And I, I love seeing when people come and see the house and they're just like, wow, this is amazing, like I want it now. And I love giving those people the opportunity to have a nice home and have that opportunity to feel at home. I've had a lot of team, um, like team building with volleyball and show choir and track and everything like that. I've had a lot of time to like grow family with my peers and it's really taught me how to lead and be a leader as well. I've also ex like had experiences with my teachers always helping me through if I'm having a tough time. They're always willing to help. They're always, yes, come on in. I'll see you at this time and you're, you're more than welcome to come in and talk to me. So it's very family based. It's very welcoming and feels safe here. My name is Terry Tai and I'm in engineering and technology for aviation flight. My plans after high school is joining the U.S. Army. The reason I chose to go this path is because it like fit my ambition the best in my life and I've always wanted to join the military and be in for like a challenge and I'm also just patriotic. I have like relatives that served in the Army and I've also just like it's something I always wanted to do since I was a kid. Well some of the experiences at Gish and the opportunities um, give you a bit of an insight into the industry of whatever career you're going into. I'm switching career fields and I'm out in aviation or am in aviation and I'm going into the military for medical so this is a complete switch. My first plan going into the military was going into aviation and I wanted to do something that was also challenging so I decided to go into medical. Um, what I'm most excited for is probably the military but it also it's just life in general because we have so much ahead of us and there's so much we can accomplish. Mm -hmm. 